Hello everyone, welcome back to the stream channel. Today, we're introducing a new car to the Vast family. Today, we're going to talk about Wasp 2104, also known as Shuguli, <laughs> again. In the mid-70s, a serious modernization of uh, classic design cars was planned. The chief designer of the Volga Auto Plant, Automobile Plant was tasked with preparing proposals for the development of the, of the model range for the 10 to 5 year plan, so as to launch a new model for, well, or a modification annually. Along with the Wasp 2105 and the luxurious 2107, stunts in the promising family, well, there was a decent place for modernized station backing. However, it only received the index of 2104. It was assumed that it will be available available in two versions, mainly with the cabin unified with Wasp 2105 and with the luxurious Wasp 2107 interior. The only difference between the saloon of the sedan well, base dance was the exclusive back seat of the Wasp 2104. It was only one piece. It was folded, and it was, and it was in a difficult condition, allowed to increase the volume of the luggage compartment from 375 to 1, 1,340 liters. The Teliati station wagon did not require anything fundamentally new, since from the front to the rear wheels, the designers planned to use the Wasp 2105 body and its units. With the roof and the and the back and the assembly technology were also inherited from established Wasp 2102. The Wasp 2104, well, only received new new tail lights, which required a change in the shape of the door and the doorway. The window of the fifth door was slightly larger than the Wasp 2102. As additional options, the rear window was heated and the rear wiper was also installed. The serial release of the quartet began in July 2nd, in the 1980s. In accordance with the plan, 5,204 5, station wagons were supposed to get off the assembly line, at least at the end of the year. However, only 1,665 managed to assemble. The design capacities for the production of Wasp 2104 were fully mastered during the 1980s. Prior to this, new station wagon was produced, in parallel with, with its predecessor, the Wasp 2102. Here, before I open this bed, this bad boy. I just want to say the the number of passengers that this car can take is four to five. Pretty average, I would say. Pretty pretty much, you know, same as the as nearly every car. The maximum speed is one hundred thirty five kilometers per hour. The acceleration time to 100, 100 kilometers per hour is fifteen seconds. Hmm, still the same as Boss twenty one oh seven. Not bad. Still better than eighteen, I guess. Okay, the packaging is a bit tough. Well, look at this. Anyway, consumers were also noted with the how do you say with the pleasure of you know of a pleasant innovation. These things, simply called the mirrors, can be adjusted directly from well from the uh, passenger co pa passenger com compartment. Back then, you you used to like you know get out and just like you know adjust them yourselves. Now you can just adjust from 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 inside. The new bumpers of aluminium for domestic cars cost, well, slight dissatisfaction for car owners. Owners, Unlike the steel ones, uh, it, used, it was difficult for them to return to their previous state after the impact or in the collision or, you know, basically in, that, in an accident. The doors of the was, was uh, of the new family were equipped with fully recessed what they call, um, handles. Largely multi-section taillights of the Soviet station wagon were, how do you say it? A curiosity. For the sake of them, even they had a uh, like, well, narrow, narrow, narrow rear doorway. The classic ladder with the station wagon body turned out to be a really excellent, uh, excellent car. At least said as the means of transporting goods. Inside, without a reason, that's why uh, Wasp Twenty O Four was has been still. I, how do you say this phrase? Still uh, runs along the road. Well, it's still seen today because you know of its. Of its uh, design and basically carry capacity and that and that's my friends that's where we're gonna wrap up the video what do you think what do you think of the car do you think this station wagon is good do you think it's an i don't know a unique innovation for the bus cars well let us let, leave, leave a comment down below what do you think of it i think it's an interesting car nothing special hey at least if it has you know large carry capacity i'm still good i mean if i was you know a soviet citizen so yeah, if you enjoyed the video, leave a like, uh, go check out our second channel that we have, the gaming channel, where we do video games and stuff, sometimes live streams and stuff. So yeah, anyway, th thanks for watching this video, and we'll see you soon.